So you're thinking about quitting your job because it's not the right fit anymore. Or maybe you've already accepted another job offer and you don't want to burn bridges with your current employer. If this sounds like you, stay tuned because in this video, you'll learn how to write the perfect resignation letter. And if you stick with me until the end, I have a special bonus just for you. If we've never met before, I'm Heather Austin from ProfessorAustin.com. And on this channel, I teach simple solutions to help you build a business or launch a career you love. So if you're new here, consider hitting that subscribe button down below. Before we jump into how to write the perfect letter of resignation, there's a few things to keep in mind. First, it's important to remember that writing a letter of resignation is good karma. A well-written letter of resignation shows that you are of good character and keeps your reputation intact. It will also hold you in good standing with your employer in case you need to use them as a reference later on. Second, your letter of resignation can be short and brief. You don't need to go into a lot of detail about why you are leaving. You want to make sure that it's to the point. And then number three, it's actually good practice to print out the letter and resign in person. However, if circumstances permit you from resigning in person, you can type the letter in an email or attach it to an email. So let's jump into how to write the perfect letter of resignation. Tip number one, customize your letter. You wanna address your supervisor or your manager in an informal but friendly manner like Dear John Doe or Dear Sally Smith. If your letter is going directly to the human resource department, address the human resource manager or director by name. Begin the letter by explaining your intention of resignation and your last day of employment. This will make it crystal clear to your employer that you are indeed resigning and when they can expect your departure. You can use a statement like this. Please accept this letter of resignation from my position as, include the position title, my last date with, include the company name, will be, and then include the date. Tip number three, explain your reasoning. In the simplest terms possible, explain why you are leaving. Some common reasons include a new career opportunity, family, health, or maybe the current position is just not the right fit anymore. Use a statement like, I recently received an offer from another organization where I can further pursue my career goals. The growth opportunities available in this new position align perfectly with my talents and aspirations. Explain your reasoning as positively and pleasantly as possible. This is not the time to complain or express your dissatisfaction. I know how hard it can be to remain up beat in your letter, especially if you had a supervisor that was impossible to work with, or maybe your values don't align with the company culture anymore. It's important to leave those unpleasant negative details out of the letter. You want to rise above this and exit with grace and ease. Tip number four, express your gratitude. Provide a brief thank you that lets your employer know that you are grateful for the career opportunities and the growth that you had while working at the company. This will be much appreciated by your employer and increases the chances that your employer will give you a good reference or a good recommendation later on. You can say something like, Thank you for allowing me to grow professionally in my role. I appreciate the support and guidance I received and the knowledge I gained while working with your company. I look forward to our continued business relationship and to hearing about the success of my colleagues. And then finally, tip number five, offer a transition. If you can, provide some type of transition, such as helping to train your replacement. This will give both you and your employer greater closure and a sense of respect for each other. For this part of your letter, you can say something like, if there is anything I can do to make my departure a seamless process, please let me know. I am happy to train a replacement if needed. Best wishes to you and to my coworkers. There you have it folks, the five tips to write the perfect letter of resignation. Thanks for hanging with me until the end. I promised you a special bonus and here it is. It's the perfect letter of resignation. It's a simple, easy to read letter that you can download and customize to 
to help you properly and confidently resign from your position. I'll go ahead and link it up below. And as always, make sure you share this video with anyone you think might benefit. Don't forget to hit the like button below and be sure to subscribe for videos every week just like this. Thanks guys and I'll see you next time.